Alrighty then, I'm working overtime today on this channel, man. So apparently, uh, the Pistons signed Kevin Knox. Now it ain't uh, <laughs> it ain't Cam Reddish, but you know what? It's pretty much the same idea. Um, in my opinion, it's definitely the same idea, man. So let's talk about it. Thumbs up the video, share the video, subscribe to the channel, the subscribe button, it's the bell icon button, hit all notifications, increase your chance, get notifications. We go live or drop a video. So why well, I say it's basically the same idea. You taking a, a, a young player who hasn't, you know, reached his potential in the league, and you know, um, you know, and put him in a different situation. Obviously, it didn't work in Atlanta, but it was only a, a sample size. You're giving him a full off season to acclimate with a young team. You know, Atlanta was young, but they was ready. You know, what I'm saying they was winning basketball game and playoff team uh, playoff games and. Or a playoff game, and you know, there was a team that went to the Eastern Conference Finals the year before. As I said many times on the channel, they flustered this year, and I figured that they might take a step back simply off the strength of you know, um, they became the honey when they were sneaking up on people, they were the, the hunter, now they became the prey, and you know, you know how that goes. So, um, I figured that with Kevin Knox getting to go to a team that's pretty much he's able to grow with, you know what I'm saying. Um, this team can grow with each other, you know, you know, they all young trying to figure it out. Nice mix of veterans, two veterans, you know, from the, uh, two veterans, you know, from the, uh, the Knicks and Burks and, uh, and, uh, Nerlens Noel. So, so yeah, it's kind of, it's kind of could be a comfortable situation for them. And, you know, that's pretty much, uh, what you like being for, and whatever reason, the Knicks eat their young. You know, whatever reason it is, the Knicks eat their young, and um, it's just hard for or for players to develop over there with the Knicks. So, and the Hawks, he got threw in in a trade in the middle of the season. You know, and his potential is there. He went to Kentucky. You got to be really, really good to go to Kentucky, and. Um, so the potential's there, forward guy. But you know, like I said before, the guys that you know I kind of was looking at that was in that kind of uh, category was Lonnie Walker. He went to the Los Angeles Lakers. Um, also was looking at a guy like Jared Culliver, um, good defensive wing, top five uh, pick, just ain't paying out in Minnesota and Memphis. Maybe gave up on him a little too quick. And um, Minnesota was a very very young team with limited success. Um, you know, so, you know, that's just something that, that you kind of looked at there. So, um, but, you know, two years, six million dollars, you got to be motivated. We get a fresh start. And I think you got to put him in a, in a, in a, even if he, I hate to say this, even if he ain't, he, he, he turned, he 22, he turned 20, turned 20, turned 20, turned 20 doesn't turn 23 until August. So I feel like you got to put him in a position and where he can be successful. But and you don't want to give it to him, but I would give him a spot in the rotation coming off the bench, get his confidence up. I talked to him like this is a clean slate, all of that. It's a clean slate, all of that. You can start over 100% over. You know, this is what we want you to do. This is what we think you do. This is what we think you can improve on. And, you know, let's go from there. But you see it, Pistons rumors, Knox agrees to two years, six million dollar contract the Hawks stint. It's very short. Pistons agree, uh, have uh, probably agreed with a two year deal with quarterly. Kevin Knox, six million dollars. Sham seven uh, stadium in the athletics. Uh, so 2018, nine, nine overall pick ended the season with the Hawks after January trade. They sent cameras to the Knicks. The change in location didn't lead to much more playing time. Knox seen just six and a half minutes per game, 17 appearances. Over the final three months, he was just a throw in. Average 2.7 points a game, 1.3 rebounds uh, per a game with the Hawks, shooting 35.6% from the field. So you're really reading to the uh, the percentages. What we do know is Cam Reddish, very talented player. His draft peers voted him the most, you know, the most likely to succeed in a draft class in the same draft class as John Moran and Zion Williamson. That's how big of a legend he was. Some people said he made a mistake going to Duke with too much talent, whatever it may be. Um, he didn't succeed over there with the Knicks neither. So, and people still believe in his talent. Obviously, Kevin Knox has been around a little bit longer. And like I said before, he played 28.8 minutes a game as a rookie. 
Think about that. And every year since then, it's damn near it went down every year. You know, he averaged 12.8 points a game. He shot 35, just under 35 percent from three. He shot from the field 37 percent, which is was which isn't great. Four and a half rebounds, 1.5 assists. So he was a, he was solid. And you go from playing 70, 57, sorry, 57 games playing 75 to going to 65 games and playing four. You know, to 42 and starting zero, or you know, four, you know, 30 and something, then 13, seven. So every year, whatever region it was, and you just a player like him, you just got to say, you know what, see what you got, fresh slate. We're going to put you here, do this, that, and the third, and go. You know, can he be that stretch forward? They got to listen as a small forward, power forward, but shit, we don't know. You know, he's a little undersized to be a power forward. Somebody in the comment section in the back video, someone he's vaguely a stretch for stretch forward. Where Bobby Portis is a stretch floor, Lori Markin is a stretch four. He's not. So if you listen to this video, delete that comment because that's the that's a dumb comment. But I mean, you look at it, uh five star across the board. In hometown was Miami, Florida. Um was born in uh Phoenix. And you know he went at number nine, so he just need a fresh slate, bro. It's the Bagley draft, excuse me. Yeah, this is the Bagley draft. I was talking about Cam Reddish. It's the Bagley draft. You know what I'm saying? So, I mean, he just gonna have to, you know, let him play, let him know we first and foremost we want effort, we want defense, and then everything else you got to bring to the table, bring it. But this is your fresh start over here in Detroit, All right? Your reputation doesn't matter here. Your reputation, once again, it doesn't matter here. So, you know, like I said before, you know, let's let's start over fresh. We want effort, defense, and then everything else. You're going to get playing time. You know, you're going to get playing time. And, um, you know, if you keep it, it's up to you. If you don't keep it, then guess what? You're going to be closer being out the league you know, going overseas. So, you know, it's up to you. It's up to you. So, but that that'll be the message that I have for him. Anything else, reputation that succeeds you here? Eh, don't worry about it. We give you a clean slate. You know, still wish they would have got a uh, Cam Reddish, but Kevin Knox will do, and hopefully he can turn it around. The number said he still can at 22 years old. Be 23 this year. So, um, yep, the number said he can. So, let's hopefully he turn it around, you know, be a baller. Let me know what you girls and guys think in the comment section. Thumbs up the video. Share the video. Subscribe to the channel. Make the subscribe button and the bell icon button. Hit all notifications. Increase your chance of the notifications. You go live and drop the video. And then you want to support the channel, cash app, dollar sign, CJ Good 313, Venmo, CJ Good 313, PayPal link description. Hit the link tree, find me on Twitch, Twitter, Instagram, Spotify, Anchor, Cash App, Venmo, PayPal. Appreciate the love and support. Let me know what's in the comment section. Peace.